to talk a little bit about your charity, but I want to I want to run this clip real quick and then have you tell us a little bit about it. Maddie, could you play clip five? I'm doing this run to raise funds and awareness for three charities. First being Calm, which seeks to raise awareness about and prevent male suicide in the UK. Secondly, Millen, which is a cancer care charity. And thirdly, WaterAid, which looks to provide clean water in countries where clean water is not available. Mate, good on you. Way to go, brother. I am so proud of you, and uh, it's great to see that you had uh, some charity to uh, really raise awareness about. So could you tell us a little bit about those charities, and are you still part of them in some ways with some of your new adventures? Um, so the ch just so I don't try and portray myself as a saint, I, I the charity angle was like I wanted just something. I was doing this anyway, and I wanted to bring like if, if I could use it to to raise money, then then I saw that as something I should do. And I, I actually chose Water Aid because I think it's the first. It's the everyone in the world deserves clean water, no matter where you are, yeah, who you are. Clean water is is just one of those things, basic rights that everyone should have. So Wood Road seemed to be doing great things. So I, I chose that charity. And then Macmillan, um, cancer, indiscriminate killer that people need help for. So um, it, is, it was just a charity that was, a, it was, I, I, they'd helped an auntie of mine and that kind of stuff. And then actually it was about two weeks, three weeks before I think I was leaving a friend invited me to a fundraiser she was putting on for Calm, which was the campaign against living miserably. Yeah, I love the title, the name. And I went along and they did a talk about male suicide in the UK. Yeah, I was like, I think at the time it was like 11 people, 11 men a day take their lives in the UK through suicide. Yeah. And I kind of saw the correlation that like I've been doing my job, felt trapped, was spiraling, but had the, the strength and support to get out. But a lot of people don't. So I um, used, I kind of just saw a comparison between the two and uh, decided that that would be a good charity to, to support. And, it, and, and, and also because it just doesn't just need money, it needs awareness that is as valuable as the money. Um, you know, and they do an amaz um, amazing things, but everything we're going through in the world today Social media, yeah. COVID, lockdowns, and all sure. that. I think the numbers up to something like eighteen yeah. men a day yeah. take their lives. So it's, it's something that's just getting worse and worse, rather than yeah. better and better. And that's with everyone being more aware and feeling mm -hmm. they can talk. So I, I don't raise money for charities anymore, just because I've asked everyone for so much money in the past. But I try to, where possible, stick a logo or talk about charities. Well, you know, hey, look, I think just here today. Uh, just the point of where we can raise awareness is very valuable and I can say this for myself as well I, when, I, when I saw these charities that you were part of uh, I was really stoked about it because I really believe there's great value here just to sort of bring out the word I saw that they have a hotline in London that you can call that's open yeah. from like 5 till through the night or something like that more people probably need to be aware of that so glad to be part of helping you get that awareness out and be part of that mission. I know that's very Thank valuable. You. Yeah, brother, good job. You know, uh, I've had some hard, hard times. When I grew up, I was one of these guys who always thought like, hey man, I never get depressed. I, what? I didn't even get it. Like I, I didn't know how people could get depressed. I was young, I was naive. But you know, I went through life and some things came at me and uh, they were hard. They're some of the hardest things I've gone through. But I got to that place one day where, you know, like I really was really was wondering, was it worth it? And it's great to know that there are avenues out there that we can, uh, mm -hmm. there's a shoulder to lean on. There's someone to talk to. And I think especially now today with COVID yeah. and the, the world that we're living in, this is a really great cause. And more people need to know that there's people out there to help support them. So far out and love that story.